Hi all! We're down in the cooler part of my basement. This is where I store my canna lilies for the winter. It can range anywhere from 57 to 60 degrees down here during the winter time and that's perfectly fine for storing canna lilies. They don't mind at all. Today they are coming out of hibernation. So come on along with me and I'll show you how I do that. All right, so here we go. There's eyes there that you can see, they're little grow tips. Uh, you can see the roots at the bottom. They're all very dry right now. Here's another one, and the grow tips are there. Again, the dry roots at the bottom. They've been in peat moss um, all winter long in my basement. I'm going to take the ones that I want to use, put them in this pot, and uh, then we're going to rehydrate them. I've got a bucket of water and I'm going to pop them right into the water and not saturate them. I'm just rehydrating them a little bit because they are very dry. Just kind of give them a little um, nudge, if you will, I guess. Um, you can see that I'm taking them out pretty much as soon as they have been put in. Maybe they're in there, oh, I don't know, 10, 20 seconds. You know, you just want to rehydrate them a little bit. Then when you're done with that, now you're going to put them in the half filled buckets of dirt. Of course, root side down, um, the, the uh, top part you can tell very easily because you've got the little eyes there that are um, starting to grow. And you can see some of the buckets that I've already done. And now they're going to need to be covered over with dirt so that the eyes are sitting pretty much just below the surface. Got one bucket there that's got to be covered, another one there. And again, just so you can see the eyes, the grow tips are up. The roots are down. You just press them into the soil just a, you know, just a little bit. And then you're going to pop more soil on top. You want to um, bury the tubers, but not super deep. Two or three inches of soil on the top is really all you need. If uh, the soil's a little clumpy coming out of the bag, just break the soil up and just smooth it around. Um, you're gonna shake the pot a little bit, just kind of like tapping everything down so that you get rid of any air pockets. Finish filling it up and then kind of like smooth everything around just so that you know you've got um, soil all the way through and around all the eyes and you shouldn't be able to see any of the uh, grow tips when you're done. They have started growing but you know give them a good amount of, of soil. Again just uh, two or three inches is really all you need. And there you have it. There's eight buckets of cana lilies. Some of them are going to go in decorative pots. Some of them are going to go into seed beds. They're down in my basement under grow lights. And the temperature right now in my basement is 64 degrees. This is not my grow room, which is much warmer than 64. But cana lilies are fine at 64 degrees. And as soon as they start uh, really growing, taking off, I will do another video. There you have it, cana lilies. Have a nice night.